Hello, this is Quentin from ServiceNow. Just wanted to show you a quick demonstration of our RPA Hub, Robotic Process Automation functionality. And uh, do a double click on the specific attended robot. Um, most of the robot for RPA we see out there are unattended. So they don't require any human uh, intervention whatsoever. But we also see use cases. Uh, use cases for attended robots. Some people will call this Assisted, assisted RPA automation, uh, we call it attended robot. So I have a piece of software here on, that you install on the end user's computer and that end user can, based on ACL access control, can uh, trigger specific attended robot to perform some of the mundane and repetitive tasks that he will have to run manually on his computer, such as grabbing data from a browser, performing data entry and things like that. Some of the tasks may still require some human input. So that's why we have this capability attended robot. So let's uh, me uh, open it so you can see the experience for the end user. In the future release, you'll be able to have a button in any workspace in ServiceNow to trigger this type of automation. Uh, currently, I'm showing the demonstration in Vancouver. So this is a piece of uh, attended software. So hopefully, yeah, I'm authenticating with ServiceNow. Uh, and I have this piece of UI to select the different bot process. Here, uh, based on my access, my ACL, I only have access to that little uh, automation, RP automation. As I was saying, in the future, we're going to have uh, API and um, UI action you can trigger directly from uh, uh, any experience in service now from a workspace. So you don't necessarily have to double click on that icon to trigger the automation directly from a customized workspace. You'll be able to trigger that attended automation. Uh, now I'm in Vancouver. This is how I select the automation. I click the play button and this will start uh, running the automation package on my laptop. We also do have a desktop in desktop function, but I'm not showing right there. Um, this attended automation could open another RDP session within my computer. So I can focus on, on doing, I can do multiple things at a time, uh, basically. So here it's just uh, grabbing a bunch of HTML table from a website. And then this attended robot is gonna be prompting me, uh, prompting for some user input to continue uh, with the process. So here you can see, I have a prompt. That prompt was designed using RPA, Design Studio by the RPA guru who created that attended uh, automation. So you can use those wind form and design and those uh, user prompt form button the way you want. Here um, it's just a logic to convert some currency, leveraging the data that the robot has grabbed as an HTML table. And that's what the RPA robot is doing. So when I click on convert, is going to just follow whatever logic my RPA admin has put in that RPA automation uh, project uh, and then uh, show uh, display the output, uh, you know, from that cal whatever calculation the system is doing underneath the cover. Right. So it's taking live data. So there's a lot of use cases, for, for example, help desk user when they are assisting um, customers or employees on the phone, they oftentimes uh, have to open a CRM or different, um, you know, browser and grab a bunch of information in different window. It's very repetitive and mundane. We could uh, provide to them specific attended robots. So um, the system will grab data from all those different portal automatically. Um, so that here I'm, I'm done showing the attended automation. Just wanted to give you a sense of the user experience. So it's, it was basically, so I'm going to close the attended robot. It was basically uh, showing you that piece of software that you have to set up on your employee's laptop. You have to grant permission to that end user so he can pick whatever bot process available and trigger them using the play button in the future. You'll even have the capability to run this from a service now workspace, just as a, another UI action on, on a modern UI uh, in the service now uh, UI. Thank you so much.